That one doesn't count. Oh, uh, um, I, uh, uh... Your hand slipped! That was it, right? Yeah, what she said. Uh, uh, you, you wouldn't mind a little do-over, right? Zero? I like that there's a visual representation of the shift. So that's what happened. You know when he went and ran into a wall? That was a shift. Did it work? But this is... Uh, quickly? Hurry, Junpei, what was your idea? Yeah, um, right. First. <gasps> what the hell? Carlos, put Akane in the fireplace. <laughs> what did we just, just do it? Punch her? Uh, this... <laughs> Junpei, what are you... Akane, listen to me. Carlos and I are going to be your shield wall. What? What? <laughs> what are you talking about? The bullets shouldn't hit you if there are two bodies in front of you. But if you do that, then you'll... It's okay. Listen, Carlos and I will protect you and die. The fuck? The Don't fuck worry. indeed? It'll be fine. Before we It'll die, be we fine? just need to shift to another history. Okay. Once you hear all of the X passes, Akane, you should follow right away. The, the X passes? In this history, five are already dead. Five's the only other one alive. That means five X passes will be revealed. If Carlos's and mine are added to that, then there'll be seven. No! Damn it, Junpei! What the hell is this plan? <laughs> this is quite a plan. <laughs> You're going to help, right? I mean, he doesn't have a choice. Ah, uh, damn it! Oh God, Please. this is horrible. Don't do this. We, we can't go back now. This is the only way. Where are we jumping? To the history when we rolled the dice and they were all ones. Okay. Let's do this then. Oh, the one Let's where he's so Akane. happy? No matter what. I'm counting on you, Carlos. No! No, 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 no! It's a shift in train! <laughs> These are the ones that have just had the miracle of rolling the dice. They got a really bad deal out of it. They weren't gonna die. Oh my god. Now announcing the current casualties. Oh my Q god, team. this is so Q. sketchy and good. Mira, Eric. D team. Diana. Sigma. C team. Carlos. Junpei. These seven are now deceased. As a result, seven X passes will be revealed. I kill fool. I kill fool. Fate. Fate. Save doll. Save doll. That is all. I kill. <laughs> but these are different. <laughs> Fate. Save doll. Save and doll, I don't have. Horrible. You're horrible, Junpei. Yeah. <laughs> well, I should go now. You just gotta accept it, Kane. That's your words. Oh my god. This is wild. Well, she can just do it without the danger. I mean, technically it is danger. Geronimo is the achievement. Right, we will hold on. Flow chart. Hold on. Oh, wait. I guess it was just going to take us straight there, but I like doing it this way anyway. <laughs> so in this one... The others are still dead, right? Yeah. Oops. Oops. That wasn't it. Um, three dice. I can't believe we've, we've just kicked them out. Let's see. I can't remember exactly how that bit ended now. 
We were really happy. We got onto a conversation about something. What in the world were you thinking? What is your problem? Look, the three of us shifted just fine, so what's the big deal? It's not okay! Uh, we did get 7x passes at least. Not you too, Carlos. I can't believe you! You always were like that, weren't you, Junpei? When we were in sixth grade, you faced those rabbit-killing middle school kids alone. Reckless? There were probably other ways of handling it, but you rushed right in. Mm -hmm. Even the shifting. It's okay because it worked, but what if I was left behind there? Well, I, uh, I figured you could escape alone then, or, or something. But that way of thinking is completely wrong. Being the sole survivor does not make me happy. There's no point in living once you lose the one you care about the most. Akane. Yeah, just, just, just slide out with that, <laughs> Carlos. Let them. <laughs> I would do the same. I'm sorry. I, I never meant to ever cause you pain like that. What's that? Well, um, remember back in elementary school, your dream was to wear a ring on your left hand? So... Oh, Junpei. What's the matter? <laughs> Junpei. <laughs> that is romantic? Junpei. Time and <laughs> oh, thank you, thank you so much. <laughs> but <laughs> you know, this is my right hand, don't you? <laughs> Wait, what? I didn't even oh, know it. You're right. It um it, it looked like the left from from my side so uh <laughs> <laughs> That's great. <laughs> <laughs> That's just like you, Junpei. <laughs> what a mistake uh, to well, make. <laughs> we'll move it to the correct finger later. <laughs> <laughs> I'll do it officially after we escape from here. So did she say yes because he didn't even ask? <laughs> I understand. He just kind of did it. So until then, I guess it's a yes. I'll leave an empty spot open. <laughs> it's been put on reserve. That's very sudden. But I'm happy for them. Except if they now jump away again. Oh, Akane, then he would still have it in a different body. Do you remember body. the X-passes for Junpei and me? Yes. Normally, when someone shifts, they forget the memories from the last timeline. But I'm used to it. It's all there. But wait, hold on. Carlos and I remember what happened before, too. Huh. I think the memories were strengthened due to the resonance effect. Those with the ability to shift... Oh. There are three of us here, so... But... I wonder why. Why have three shifters gathered in a place like this? Doesn't really yeah, seem like a coincidence. It's not even just three, is it? Huh. True. At least five. Even if we really are seeing more shifters in the world, the probability... Wait. The is... numbers are increasing? Mankind is about to face an unprecedented crisis. Oh, as it stands now, we'll lose six billion lives. I assume mankind has sensed that and is adapting. Even though it's, in reality, only a small portion. There's no way there are tens of thousands of shifters. Then it's definitely on purpose. 
But we signed up for DCOM of our own free will. Wait a minute. But maybe we just think that. And in actuality, we did exactly what Zero wanted? It's highly possible. Ah, damn! What is that bastard thinking? Wasn't it because he needed us to shift? Why would that be important? Don't know. I don't know. It'll all be over once we get out of here anyway. You're right. We couldn't care less what Zero has planned at this point. We need six X-Passes. We know five of them already, so one more. Akane, tell us one of the other X-Passes. It's save. So, right, he is what? So the X-Passes, right? Save and doll were the new ones, but I have a list here of the same ones, like I Kill Fool, Moon and Fate, but they had different ones before. Uh, Carlos was Hero, Junpei was Hate, but now instead of Hero and Hate, it's Save and Doll. But, um, I wanted to say something there about... So, like, what if, right? The thing that Akane isn't thinking that could so easily happen, right? What if another version of her now jumps into this one and screws up the entire plan? Like, you know what I mean? Like, she would be so unhappy. I mean, I understand that she's accepted that, so I guess all versions of her has accepted it. But, like, there's so much potential for it to go wrong as well. So, right, save. Error. Mm hmm. Yep. Hey! What the hell? He's put different wait, wait. X passes. Is, for is different the X pass wrong somehow? Th for that can't be! Timelines. Yeah, let's try the other one too! Yeah, I know what it is! Akane! Uh, I have them it's all! It's dull! It's not, it's hero or hate. I'm sure of it. Or hex. Or maybe it doesn't work because they're alive? What the? No way. But why? X passes are sent to their respective histories. Yeah. X passes from alternate timelines are not. Hey, that's the first time that's been acknowledged. Like by the. What? Not no. zero, but the announcer. So we are definitely here for <laughs> jumping shenanigans. <laughs> It's okay, I can solve this. I've literally got it here. Junpei. <laughs> now this is hilarious. How perfect. Why? Why did we even struggle through all of that just it's now? It's okay, Junpei. Calm. Those guns turned my body into Swiss cheese. And you're telling me that it was all for nothing. All we did was die in vain? No, it's okay, we've got this. So, just one person needs to die. Oh no, jump in. What? Stop. Just just one more person, and Akane and Carlos can Junpei. You Wait, Junpei! Oh my god, hey. tackle him! Get him! Oh no. Excuse me? What the fuck is going Ooh. on? Junpei! Uh, you are... Penalty. Penalty. You are charged with a rule violation. That means you must be punished. B punished? Time to exterminate. Exterminate? Uh... What the fuck is happening? Kone. Just charging at everyone with the uppercuts. Oh my god, super strong. Oh, he's so strong. Any more those punches? Is he a robot? 
This is... Why are we seeing things from them? That, that was a cutie. Are they meant to be dead? What? How? How did I see cutie? I don't know. I've got that question too. Diana's no been doing it a whole I time. Do if I die now, Junpei and Akane, think. I gotta think. Uh, there must be a way. Some way to survive this situation. Ah, uh, there has to be. I believe that what you just did was shift, Carlos. That's it. Shift. Shift into the shift. one that we There's saw. No way I'm leaving Junpei and Akane behind. I'll come up with a plan in another history and jump right back. Uh, where do I go? Which history should I jump to? Damn it! I don't have time to think. The Finn. one where they're already getting out, right? Oh, oh, oh! Maybe we thought for too long. No, no, are we should. Are we shifting? What the fuck? What is going on with Q? What was that? Why was? He was talking like a robot. What is the deal? Why is he so strong? Why is his eyes red? Why is he saying exterminate? Is he a Dalek? He's an alien. He's an alien. Oops. Oh shit, we jump. Okay, we're jumping to the. Oh. We're jumping to here, which is, um. Oh, this is so good. Um. Kalos Sin. This is where we've already killed Akane, right? With an axe. Is this the one where our hands chopped off? This is so cool. Uh, Junpei. Uh, uh, I'm sorry. I couldn't. So we should never ever kill Junpei while she's Akane? alive. Never. I I just killed <laughs> Is that why we've jumped to this? Because we're in very distress? Oh, so now we, that version of us who's just killed Akane is teleported to just about to be uppercut again by Q. <gasps> no. Why is Akane? Oh my god, he's like seeing it. This is the history where Akane was killed. I, I killed her. Don't panic no, about that. I didn't kill her. The one who did was me from this history. Oh, this can't be kept like this. I need to do something at least. Oh my god. So we've got to come up with a plan and then get into another load of danger. The anesthetic worked somehow. The pain's dull. Don't know how long it'll last. Regardless, who was that kid? Why did Q out who he is turn into a horror monster? Yeah. There's one more thing I need to do. Maybe someone killed Gob. That vision I saw. I have to tell Q team. Search the family portrait. I'm counting on you, Gab. Q team. What now is, then. What does that mean? Is, figuring out who that kid is. He might have been the one who killed Junpei in this history. 
search the family portrait. What am I missing there? <laughs> hey, all sections cleared. Wait, now what? Don't make me get off this train. Oh, shit. Oh, bloody hell. Search the family portrait to Q team. What on earth made us say that? Hmm. I don't see no more exclamation marks. Oh my god. This is so good. Um Let's have a quick look here. Oh, we've opened some new stuff! Oh, it's zero. Okay. I mean, well, this is where we're going next. There's no stopping us now. Let me just do a save. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, boy. What is this crack here? We gotta find out right now. Reality. Ooh, I wonder if I could go back and put a different code in. The X passes, because I've got huh? them. Why am I the only one here? Hey, Mira? Uh, Eric? Now announcing the current casualties. C team, Carlos, Akane, Junpei. Q team, Eric. D team, Diana, Bai, Sigma. These seven are now deceased. <laughs> no! Oh, and Mira's the gone. has been opened and subsequently closed. The successful escapee no, no, that's a lie. The decision has now been concluded. Thank you for participating. This isn't the time we stayed behind. What is? Because Eric went as Why well, didn't are we? seven people? Oh, so that's the time. Yeah, okay. This is the time that Mira went stabby. Oh, and that was the same time. But yeah, we got stabbed in the chest. But we survived it. I knew it. I knew it. I put that together. I didn't know it, but how did we survive that then? What was all that? Did we jump? Why no. did I see C team and D team? No, because that's this. And anyway. Why am I even alive right now? Oh my god. I remember being stabbed by a scalpel. Tell me, Zero. Do you truly wish to know? Yes! Zero. Tell me. I suggest you come to the quantum computer now. Everything will be explained there. Get a scoot on. Quantum computer dome? We're doing it. Getting answers? Are we getting answers? You... <coughs> you detest me, I suppose. You are welcome to kill me now, if you wish. It should be easy if you put your mind to it. I... I... I want to know the truth. Stop! Very well. Many cues. What? What is this? 
your spare bodies. My spare? They were prepared in order to support me and my plan. They function mainly as physical labor, plus other additional deeds. Okay. No. Then... Then I'm... Precisely. You... are not human. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. The consciousness that is you does not reside in that body. Your thought center is there. Within the quantum computer. Okay. You so, he's like a lunar. and make decisions in there. You then output the results into commands that are transmitted to your body. And it then moves according to those commands. So that's why I didn't die back then. Indeed. Then me not having any memories. Clearly you wouldn't, as you've just come into existence. Okay. Only just now. Well, then... What's this? This? I know there's something here. It's warm, and it feels like it has a presence. Hmm. I can only assume it's a remnant of the boy you were modeled off of. He struggled with an incurable disease, and lost his life at the age of ten. Who was he? He was called Sean. Sean. The same name as you. Sure. But that's not who I am, is it? Correct. He was simply used as the model to create your personality. Oh. Is he the one that didn't okay. get his surgery? I see. Then... Because of the snail? I'm just a program. My consciousness isn't inside this body. What does that matter? Have you considered humans may be the same? Not all humans retain their consciousness inside their brains. Perhaps they exist in an alternate dimension, and they may be thinking from there. They then send out their results via relays to their brain. Not if this is true, field. then no contradictions exist within cerebrum physiology. If the relay breaks, then your body is unable to recognize commands or function properly. Both are actual phenomena that occur. If nothing else, we're unable to prove that this theory is not correct. Kind of convincing me that's actually real, you know? <laughs> um, can I ask you something? Why did you... Give me a personality. If you wanted an assistant, uh, wouldn't a simple robot following commands be enough? I... Uh, I wanted to see the world as you did. The world of that boy. Sean. What? Uh, what do you mean? There will be no more. Hey, I wanted to wait. see the world as you did. We'll speak later. Right now, I have something that I need you to do. Play the game. The decision game. Why? The game's already over. That is in regards to the others. You are an exception. What? I shall explain the rules. You can see a button right here. Your choices should be obvious. Press it, or refuse to do so. And if I push it? That computer there retains all of the data that makes you uniquely you. Memory, personality, how you think and sense. All of the algorithms that determine your actions are stored inside. If you choose to press the button, all of the data will be duplicated and transferred to a virtual space. It is there that a copy of you will continue mm -hmm. to live. 
But will this one shut down or something? Is there a catch? Is created to be essentially an exact match to reality. There is no way you'll realize it is false. The copy of you that is inserted within the space will live a happy life. However, that is strictly within the world of simulation. Mm -hmm. In the real world, your original self will still be required to stay and exist. The original and copy have no differences. The data is exactly the same. It will be What's the catch? Without any discrepancies. Essentially, the moment you press the button, uh -huh. your existence splits in two. One of you will be in the virtual space, while the other remains in reality. Then what happens if I don't want to push it? All data pertaining to you will be deleted. Without a trace. There are no backups. It will be impossible to recover your data. Do you mean for all of his helpers as well? The button, then means your existence will be erased and you will receive a complete death. Why would we want that? Uh, a complete death? Give me more info, dude. Your fate is narrowed to three possibilities. Press the button and move to virtual space. Press the button and stay in the real world. Refuse to press it and welcome complete death. You only get two options, however. To press this button right. to refuse. What will you decide? The third option, like the third route, sorry, is and isn't our fate, though. Future will be forever altered. I, I. He hasn't given us a good case for wanting to have a complete death. Is it because we're going to be used as a slave, but a version of us gets to live on? I mean, I'm pressing it, <laughs> but I don't quite know. This is probably bad, right? I don't feel like he's given us a fair amount of information here. Beginning transfer of program. Sean 729 to virtual space. Why wouldn't we want that? I want that. If I could do that, I would do that too. I wouldn't get to live in the virtual space. But at least another version of me would. And I think that version of me would be very grateful to this version of me. Like, it would have been a more harder choice if we were given up this life or something. What's the deal? What's the deal? Why? Okay, so these have opened and we can go back there. Oh, cool. So we can choose to go to the virtual one and the real one. I guess. And then this is the one if no one... Okay, okay. Let's go to this one, I guess. Is it going to be real or virtual? And are we going to be able to tell? It sounds virtual. Huh? <laughs> oh my god. Sean, you're awake. Where am I? What am I? Your surgery was a success. Your illness is completely gone now. Mom? I'm so proud of you, Sean. Dad? What's the matter? You look a little out of it. Are you alright? I mean, I've just had a surgery, oh. apparently. Uh, well, actually... I think I must have had a yeah. really bad dream. We had a shit just happen. <laughs> anyway, what do you want to eat when you get out? Yeah. We gotta start planning where you want to visit, too. Uh, okay. Congrats on getting released, son. <laughs> Thanks. Food's ready! 
Make sure to eat up. I made sure to make all of your favorites today. Wow, your meat pie. And mashed potatoes, peanut butter, and celery sticks. Yay! Hey now, don't think that's it. Oh my gosh! The game system I always wanted! And all the books I've ever wanted to read! You fought really hard against your illness. So you deserve a reward. Dad, Mom, thank you so much. The woman's voice sounded like a Akane, but I'm really stretching probably there. I've overcome my illness, and I'm going to school now. I have a whole bunch of friends, and I can read all the books I want at the library. Aww. I need to study super hard to catch up on all the stuff I missed while I was in the hospital. Dad and Mom, they tell me they love me all the time. And every day is fun. I gotta be the world's happiest kid. No. So this is the simulation. Achievement unlock virtual reality. Happy end! Oh, with a little present. Oh, okay. Is that the goal? <laughs> Is that actually one of the endings? No. <laughs> so... He wanted Sean to... No, right? He gave us the choice. I'm s <sighs> He based it on this little boy who was meant to have the surgery, who I assume is the one that didn't have the surgery because of the doctor being killed. So he he's made this as if he can continue to go on now. But why did he like give him the choice and... Hmm. Oh my goodness, this is so strange. So, but right now I'm really scared. Absolutely perfect ending. At what cost? Positive music? Uh, zero? Why is it that I'm still on this side? Well, he told us that. In that virtual space? I'm, well, an identical version of me is living out a great, happy life. Why, why am I here? Because y'all, you... I have an old story to tell you. A senior citizen and a boy with an incurable disease met at Senior a citizen. The child was always reading books significantly above his level. This is us. The majority of his young life was spent confined to a hospital bed. So books were his only friends. The boy had a special ability. He was extraordinarily gifted. His ability was highly regarded by his elder. So, in exchange for new books every day, the boy would share his academic knowledge. The boy was told that when his disease was cured, he was welcome to a job. However, Life was unfair. The path to the child's future closed after a variety of coincidences. The snail effect. Up. The boy just laughed. He never laid blame. He simply, quietly, accepted his fate. He did not despair. Giving up on his life did not mean he gave up on his dreams. Before he died, he shared them with his old friend. And that dream is finally... What are you talking about? The universe. 
This quantum computer contains all of the infinite number of realities within space. Let's suppose there's someone, somewhere, who can fully operate that program. Perhaps he'll find that he can traverse the universe. What? Traverse the universe? 6140 <gasps> Oh, I need this. Fuck, I missed it. <laughs> what are you saying? Be sure you remember that. No, go back! A time will come when it will be handy. Look! <laughs> I took a photo and it flashed right off the screen as I did it. That was fast. All right, I've got the number. 61404091. We need that. <laughs> Oh god. No way. Oh my god, is it just is it just that? <laughs> okay. Oh shit! He's got no head. Ah! Oh my god! <laughs> what was that horrifying? That would make you scream. Oh! Oh! Oh my god! Heads are rolling. Shit. Okay. So. <laughs> I'm so stressed at this. Right, we've just learned a lot of stuff. That quantum computer has all the realities in the world in it, except, but they, they're virtual, right? I'm gonna need more information. I'm, I'm not really making any conclusions. We did find out Senior Citizen was probably zero, right? So he's old and he wanted to make the boy's dream a reality and the dream was the universe. Hmm. I mean, he's had, he's done it, he's done one good thing, which is put the virtual robot living a really nice life, if it's sentient. Uh, there's something else we have to do. We have to go and not push the button. This is not going to be good, but... We might get some more information Your that helps. To three right. Oh god. Wasn't there never much blood whenever Q died? Is that why? Because he's not not a real boy. So, that is your decision. Why? Like, there's no logical reason we would choose death. It's fine. I just want you to end it. I see. Then, farewell. And he's left it up to the boy to decide. So it wasn't, there wasn't like this big cost. Deletion complete. Is that every version of him or is it just this version? Does he still have the base version in all those other bodies? Game over. Yeah, that was a fast one. Okay. So where is this one? Let us have a look. 
Flow. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Well, this one is the time that... I wonder if there'll be another... I'd love it if there was another jump train because <laughs> that was really fun um so much happened i want to go back to wherever it was but i don't think we can where we could push the buttons when was it after the dice yeah there's still one we haven't got oh, oh we can't do it from this menu i keep forgetting um So what's this? The boy in the ring. Right, what I want to do then. Oh shit, sorry. Hold on. I want to Wait, let's cuz I also have this number, right? It's an eight digit number. I don't know if it's even going to be relevant anywhere else. Um Maybe it opens this box. It can't open the other boxes, probably. I would try it on the box. Maybe I'll try it on the box. I'm gonna try it on the box. <laughs> if I do that, and it doesn't work, then fine. If it does work, then... I just can't remember what... Force quick cue. I can't remember what... Like, where we were with that. Like, what kind of cord it needed and stuff like that. But also, yeah, we haven't even watched this bit yet. Now announcing the current casualties. Presently, there are... This will also put it on the floor chart, right? None. Oh, this Please is... continue enjoying mm. the decision game. They're just messing with us. This is the well, good part. This is good, though. Now we know no one's died so far. So far, you make it sound like somebody will die. Oh, there's no head under there. Isn't that obvious? We're all human. Oh, come on. There's no way I'm dying of old age here. Oh, but I guess the vote at 1330 went really well. Sounds like everyone spread the votes out. Wait, forget that for now. Look at your bracelets. Zero, 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 three? That's 12 hours. Not exactly a... Happy New Year kind of well, mood, is it? 11 hours? Yeah, there's nothing to be happy about. There is! The death count is zero. That's plenty to be happy over. The button happened between then, didn't it? The showers. That being said, how about a celebratory shot? <sighs> Do you need to rub it in? Oh, that's right. You're still a minor. And I don't have a mouth! That's not what I meant at all. Uh, his head... He's got a giant metal orb on his head, remember? Oh, that thing. Well, don't you have some sort of mouth part to open? No, of course I don't. If it opened, it would have done that along. It's open. Huh? Look, the box, the force quit box. Wait, it's just already open? Let's check it out. Excuse? Uh, why is it open? And what's up with this weird device? Huh, something's displayed on the monitor here. It says, to execute the force quit program, the central control computer must be booted. Central control computer? What if... maybe it's... Hey, where are you going? Are we in the uh, quantum area? We must be. Oh boy. Are we going to that quantum computer room? Uh oh, we are. Where are we? The map says we're in... The quantum computer dome. Dome, sorry. The computers dome. in here govern all the functions that run within the shelter. Why do you know that? I can't really tell you why. Because I don't know. 
What? Anyway, I think they mean this when they say central control computer. So, what about that thing? Code! I feel like I'm remembering something. I have a code! I know. Don't put it in our helmet. No, what? The way you start up the system. First, we need to get the cover off. There's no way we can insert the plug if we don't. The plug? Please, just shh. Shush, Eric. I think the number is... Six one four zero something something nine four six one four oh I wish I could remember <laughs> I've got the picture no problem uh six one four or four or nine one I was close is that not it is that not it Okay, we need something else. <laughs> uh, I don't know it. if it's not that. I don't have any other numbers. Uh, one more try. Did I type it wrong twice? What was it? Uh. Come on. Uh-oh, if we just... Okay. If you get it wrong a certain amount of times, you just get kicked out. <laughs> Thank God. At first I thought I'd just typed it wrong twice in a row and then I got it right on the third time. <laughs> but no, it's not that. Okay, so wait, that one was different. That box was open. This one's open too. This one isn't though. Okay, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to watch this one. And then I'm going to see if I can go to the dice one and, and figure that out. Oh, we're a bit all over the place here. But it's going to be worth. We don't even know what it means by false quit. That's the thing. Now None. None. Please continue. It's so each person, each team is having to find their own different code for their own different hey, thing. Excuse me, but uh, could we maybe call a cab? We have a lost child here. Who are you talking about? Well, best to get her home soon. Her mother must be worried. And you know better than anyone that I don't have one. Good God. Zero, 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 three? What on earth was that? We're in the new year now. So it's no longer 2028, but... January 1st, 2029. Our memories end after we voted at 1330. Yeah, 11 hours. Now we're stuck with a 10 hour blank gap. 10 hours? But were we really asleep that whole time? We might have woken up several times since then, but we've only forgotten about it. Because of the drugs. Huh. Hey look, the box. Box? The force quit box. It opened. Okay, it's the same inside as the other one. Why is it open? No idea. There's text displayed on the monitor. Force quit program on standby. To initiate, two key items must be set. Huh, how about that? Wait, I think there's more to the message. Each is a mother's memento. A mother's memento? Diana. Does any of that ring a bell for you? <laughs> no! 
Hey, what's wrong? My head! My head! I need to hear that again, but I don't want to... That can't be! But what is it? Did you remember something? Is it the but badge? The brooch? If that's true... Then the key items we need to insert are... Hold, hold, hold. Hold on. Suspense. Um, is it going to make me write something? Two key items must be set. Wait, what? Force quit program on standby. To initiate, two key items must be set. How about that? Wait, I think that each is a mother's memento. So the, the brooch. Is she wearing the bird necklace? Oh, I don't know the other one. I mean, I'm literally just making that up as well. <laughs> uh, a mother's memento. I'm absolutely racking my brains. I don't know it, I don't think. I'll have to think a bit more. My choice is made! You get three tries and you're out. Huh. I, I wonder why I... What's the matter? I thought I remembered. But then it slipped through my fingers. Sorry. I can't believe it. My bad. Wait. I know I can get it. Let me try again. Wait, do I have to do it again? Oh no, there we go. <laughs> That's like, that hasn't made me remember. Uh, right. Let me just save again. <laughs> so... Did that... Did they now go on to here or not? No, the force quit boxes aren't actually even on here. Okay. We're doing good with these ones though. Right, let's let's just refresh our brain. Who killed Mira? Three-way standoff. Oh, yeah. Oh, maybe at this point, when everyone's just pointing guns at each other, we can just be like, hey, check this out, and put our cord into our head, and then our head rolls off, and they're like, whoa. <laughs> and then nobody gets killed. Maybe? That could be an option. Um... So there's there, there. This we just, we don't even have any choices there. This also just stops. This one's locked. And this one's locked. Oh, the stranded pair, this is, this is the one where, they, yeah, they transported and found a door. Boy in the ring, I think is what I'm going to go back to now. And then if that doesn't do anything, I'm going to go back to the the shooty time and see if we can make our head roll off. Just for a distraction. So we go here. I don't think this is going to do it. I don't even know if this is the right, the right thing. Hmm. Look, the three. Uh, you and E. Well, so we should uh fast forward then. I'm gonna say we shift in. E uh, what did I say? Hero. Mm, fuck. 
Uh, it's just not going to even work, is it? I've literally wrote them all down, game! I'm sure these are from the same... No, right, this is the one where we... I guess every single separate thing has different ones. Which is like... This is a different reality to any other reality that we've ever been in, so... Doesn't work. Hex was one. And... Hate was Junkers. Shit. And then... I kill full. Moon hate. Moon fate. Future can't have been one because there's only five letters. Where did I get that from? What? Okay. Shit. Well. Didn't work. Worth a try though. Worth a try. Yes. Um. Shit. Okay. Um. Let's try this one. If this doesn't give me an option to do that, then... Which I don't think it will, because I think if it did, it would give me an exclamation mark, because it was something new. So if not, then what? Maybe I know the mother's memento? Can I just type the code? Oh, I don't have numbers, so I was like, can I just type the code in? <laughs> Sean doesn't wait, wait, is that how it was spelled? Fine. I already tried, uh, what could the fourth answer be? There was something in this room that we didn't even use, right? Senior citizen is the only identity we know so far, I guess. I don't have anything. Um... Nah, literally nothing. I've got nothing. <sighs> hmm. Right, I need to do a refresh of everything. Right, this one looks done. Oh, that oh. one is just one. This one done. This one done. That's the coin flip. That's the execution. Yeah. So we still got a we've got a lock. Like it's actually a lock, so it'll tell us when we've unlocked this. Uh this one's done. This one needed a cord. Hmm. This one's done. So all we can do for these guys is a cord for this. It seems. Right. This one also needed a cord. But not the cord that we've got. This one's done. I'm checking everything to make sure I don't miss anything out. Done. Done. This one is easily done. Done again. So we have something here. 
a name. Who are we going to kill? No idea. And who killed Mira? And we tried loads of things on this one. Hmm. Okay. So there's two things that we can do here. Well, three, I guess. So, right, there's two things actually. No, no, no. There's only the code for these guys. There's three things for these guys. Okay, done. What's this one? Oh, right. The, the, the box, we need a code. No, we don't. We need a mother's memento. And we've got the brooch. Uh, hmm. That one's done now. This one's locked, so I'm not counting it for now. Okay, we need a door for the... A door for the code of truth. <laughs> Just looked at that one already. This one's done. Hmm. Okay, well, based on that, we should have the answer to something. And it's either going to be a chord, who killed Mira, who to kill, Oh, the mother's mementos. And I feel like it's got to be that one. Because we know we've got Fi's brooch. But I can't think of anything else. I might have to stop here for today, have a think. And see if I can figure anything out. I really had my hopes set on that cord. Who killed Mira? We don't have any names. Again, there's this room, but like it doesn't seem like redoing it is the way. I think if anything, we'll be back here later to use that chair oh. again or whatever it was. That, like there was a clue. It was like something, something, something. I've forgotten what it was, but there was a clue that we didn't use. Um. Is there just been a little conversation that I didn't, I didn't catch? The hair clip? Could that be off her mom? <laughs> I'm really reaching now. <laughs> I don't remember how many letters it is. Oh no. And I don't remember Sigma ever talking about his mum. Wait. Could it be in the conversation that was had when Fi and her were talking? Her clip doesn't fit. Hair slides. <laughs> uh, her skirt, her jumper, red hair, ginger. the anagrams was saying the truth is invisible still don't know what it means though 
เอาน่า I think it's time that I just take a break and have a think and then if I can't think of anything get a hint um huh. what's But honestly, I, I can't think of anything right now. Hmm. I'm gonna write down everything I've just been through, and then let it stew for a little bit and see, see if I can come up with anything for the next session. All right. Um. Okay. I'll probably, if I can't think of anything, I'll get a hint. To find out which things it is that we do know, so that I know where to focus, you know, because there's no point in focusing on a code that we don't have yet. Um, but other than that, I don't. Yeah, I don't know. All right, but this is, whoa, this has been, this has been a session. <laughs> like we have learned so much stuff. Um, Fire's ginger hair seems important. I don't know why that's the thing that's standing out to me right now. Um, the whole shift train was so good. I, that, I think that's been my favorite part so far. Um, and like, but I really like thinking about like how it must feel, not only for themselves but for the the people that they're kicking out of their own body, right? And then we've had the whole revelation that Q is a robot. Um, I think robot, unless his body is biological and just cyborg. I'm not sure, but um, his brain is in a quantum computer, which also houses simulations of many universes. I think. Obviously, we. Cannot be transferred into that, but a version of him got transferred into that to live happily ever after, and it was really nice. And then we found out that he doesn't have a head. <laughs> and then we also met one of his other bodies, or maybe it was this this version of the body. I don't know. That was being commanded to execute because, like. He said, "This is who's been doing the clean up. These little cues. His name is actually Sean. Um, huh. We know that Q is based off the person who died because of a result of the snail incident. Um." Hmm. But actually, technically, Mira is to blame for that, right? I feel anyway. <laughs> um. Huh. My mind is just like going over everything and trying to make some sense of it. And most of it makes sense, I think. I'm just not connecting some dots just yet. But maybe we don't have the middle dots to connect to yet. Maybe we do, and I'm just not making it. But I've really enjoyed that anyway, and um, I'm just looking forward to now making sense of some stuff, but also just figuring out where to go next. So I will thank you guys for watching, and I will see you soon. Be back soon uh, with some answers, hopefully, <laughs> and some endings, maybe. We got an end today. Oh, that's right. I even forgot to just mention in my summary there that we got the ending that led onto VLR, which is freaking amazing. Like, it's like, oh, it happened again. <laughs> we did the exact same thing that we did the first time. So that's like, that's something that happened, which was very cool. Probably like my second favorite thing so far. So yeah. Very cool. Really enjoying it and I'll see you guys soon. Bye bye.